guys, it's Elle. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be my weekly plan with me. Um, I just have everything that I'm going to be kind of pulling from um, here just so that you can get a quick glance to, at it, I should say. I'm not obviously going to use everything. I just pulled different sticker sheets from different places, but I just obviously wanted everything in front of me so that this video is not 20 hours long with me picking and choosing things from books. So I've just pulled out things that I'm interested in using in this week's spread. I am going to be using, and I just want to move this aside, I am going to be using the Big Happy Planner um, this week, and we're going to go ahead and get into it. So I'm just going to open this up because that ring light can be a pain in the ass <laughs> with how bright it is. And we are going to be planning in the week of August 6th through August 12th. So I'm just going to take these sheets out. So here are the pages laid out. And what I decided to do for this week's spread, as I was going through last week's spread, just picking out my stickers and that sort of thing, I started kind of getting a feel for a lot of the greens and the blues and the pinks and just very vibrant colors. And a new theme had hit, kind of hit me out of nowhere for this week. And I wanted to base this spread on Kate Spade. Um, as I think everyone knows, unfortunately, not too long ago, Kate Spade uh, committed suicide. Um, she is one of my very favorite designers in everything, purses, clothing, housewares, all of it. And I think that a lot of people were kind of shocked because whenever you look at her pictures when she's out at a function, when she was out as, at a function, she was dressed in these gorgeous bright pinks and oranges and greens and always had a big smile on her face. Um, and you know, without getting too deep into everything with suicide and feeling depressed and that sort of thing, um, you know, of course it's one of those things where you think about this person looked absolutely to be in the best of health, mentally happy all the time, had lots of money, lived on Park Avenue, all this stuff. Um, so for me, this spread is just going to be inspirational. It's going to be positive. It's going to be an uplifting type of spread. And because of the colors and because I just, you know, thought they were so synonymous with Kate Spade, the company, all of the stuff that they put out, um, you'll see a lot of quotes and inspirational things that are just meant to be uplifting in people's lives. So I have the two sheets down. The washi that I put down here is from... Uh, I want to say it's Jane Davenport. She can be found, um, a lot of her collection can be found at Michael's, and I've talked about it before, but that is the washi roll. And as you can see here, hopefully the camera's picking it up. Let me just zoom you in a little bit there. You can see these purples, blues, light blues, greens, pinks and reds, and just kind of this mishmash of really nice, vibrant color, almost like a watercolor stain. So I thought that that would be um, very... Um, very appropriate for this spread. So what I'm going to do is I am just going to move the sixth over or the, the first page onto the second page and we're going to work in that manner so that um, there's not too much going on in the background and we can concentrate on this one page. So the way I actually want to start this week instead of doing my full boxes, I'm going to start with a bunch of headers. And here I have a um, page from one of the Happy Planner sticker books. I can't recall which one it is. I just kind of pull them out as I need them or want them, but I own so many of those books as well. But again, if you're looking at the color scheme here, you've got the greens and the reds, the light blues, some more green, purple, pink. So what I want to do is I want to put these headers down in the last boxes here where it says reflection today was thankful for, because um, we can still do that. And I kind of want to do that. Maybe like put a um, an uplifting quote to myself or some words of encouragement to myself each day down here, but I want to start out with colorful headers. So I am going to start out with the today header right here, which is kind of a light blue. Actually, I'm going to grab my tweezers. It just helps me so that my fat fingers aren't in the way. And because when I'm planning and putting stickers down, I really get a bout of OCD and want to make sure that everything is perfect or near perfect as I can get it. So there's that. And then I'm going to grab this green Love This sticker. Again, we just want to maintain these nice, bright, fun colors that, um, you know, she was known for and the company is still very well known for. I probably should have whited out these words too. Didn't think about that. 
but that's okay. And then the details, I'll put that down because I like that pink. All right, and then on the second page, I'm going to done what I should have done on the first page and wipe some of this stuff out. So let me just do that quickly. That way you're not really going to see the lettering there. Oh, it went a little over, so let's see if we can't mush that down a bit. All right, and so I'm going to continue on with my headers here. I'm going to put Happy Day, this pretty kind of turquoise color. Then Hello Darling. Let me just make sure I didn't put this one over here. I didn't. It's just the colors kind of are the same. Then I want to put this one that says Celebrate right here. And then Enjoy Today. So those headers are down. Let me just move the sticker sheet out of the way. So those headers are down and the color scheme is already coming together beautifully, especially with these greens and the blues. That's There's a green that I call Kate Spade green and I kid you not, I went one time to Home Goods and I was looking for a Kate Spade lamp. Didn't know what I was, you know, like necessarily looking for because Home Goods, you know, they kind of get in what they get in. As soon as I saw this lamp, I knew it was Kate Spade green, and I didn't even have to look at the tag. When I got there and I looked at the tag, it was Kate Spade. So that tells you all you need to know <laughs> about how much I love Kate Spade colors. So what I'm going to do across the middle is I'm just going to put down some full boxes, again, that kind of embody that color um, range, and also uh, things that are inspirational and uplifting. And... Yes, it's true. There's nothing better than a friend, but if that friend has chocolate, they are the bomb. The bomb.com. Love a friend with chocolate. So I'm just going to place this here. What I'm going to do is I'm actually going to start closer to the top here because in case it gets down into the stickers, I really wouldn't want it to do that. So we've got a little space there, there but that's okay. That's not a problem. And then I'm going to put down this one that says Hello Friends, a really nice bright pink. And I'm going to stay right on this sheet. I love this one right here that says You Are Pretty. Words of encouragement, positive affirmations, you know, just being nice and giving someone a really nice compliment especially when they're not necessarily expecting it, I think can make all the difference in how a person feels, um, whether it's for that moment, for the day, or for the rest of their lives. So I love the fact that, you know, the stickers that I'm using here are just kind of full of that situation where it's really positive stuff. So I'm going to do this one that says, Hello Sunshine. It's a nice graphic black there. I'm going to do the same thing here. I'm going to start higher up on the box. Just make sure we have that lined up with the side there. And then this one also fits that color scheme. Can't stop, won't stop. It's great because I can with these stickers because I can just use the one that I previously put down as a guide for the next one after that. And then this one says never ever settle. And then for Sunday, I think we're gonna go with this fun one right here that just says the best. Oh, and it's cool. It's like a little tap, so 
We'll start down here instead, since the tab is up top, and just perfect. So it's not a full box on this side, but this is fine because I'll use this for a list of what I need to do on Sunday for my channel. So that is the way the spread is looking. Let me just zoom you out a bit with the full boxes in the middle and then the headers here. Um, I'm really liking the way this is turning out so far. So let's go ahead and continue. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do my daily stuff. On Monday, I do have a doctor's appointment first thing in the morning. Not like I want to go, but it's got to get done. I've got to get my annual physical. So say la vie, what are you going to do? So I want to put down a box for that. So let me just look to see what can work here. So this sticker sheet also from a happy planner sticker book has great appointment today, like uh, quarter boxes and also don't forget half boxes. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to pull, let's see, probably this nice deep green one right here that says appointment today. And I'm just going to put that down up top. Actually, I'm going to put it down a little lower in case I want to put some sort of header or something there. So I'm going to put that there and then later on I'll write in what needs to get written in. So I've got that. And so Tuesday I don't have um, anything going on except working, but on Wednesday my son does have a dental appointment. So I want to put down this don't forget sticker and I'm going to try to line it up as best I can with the green sticker I put down for my appointment on Monday. So that is Wednesday. And then on Thursday, what I am probably going to do is leave work early. Um, my son is on vacation again this week. My mom hasn't, but I think I may leave early to go do a little shopping because I get paid um, that day. And so I want to get to Michael's and Hobby Lobby, maybe Joanne's, but definitely Michael's and Hobby Lobby. So I want to put down a box um, to not forget to shop because, of course, that's quite important to do, especially when it's all of the things that Michael and Hobby Lobby has. So I pulled this to buy sticker. It's almost a full box just in um, height, but not necessarily in length. Um, but it says to buy here. So I want to pull that in. And again, the colors are very perfect for this layout. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put this at the bottom here and just kind of eyeball it to put it there at the bottom and kind of center it there. So that's that. So that way I'll just list the stores that I want to go to that day. Um, Friday, again, another day that, you know, I'm working, so it's not necessarily a lot to do. But then Saturday and Sunday, of course, we get into my filming, editing, and uploading type of situation. So I'm going to get a couple of boxes to uh, note those things down. I'm just going to grab one of these empty boxes. This is also from... Um, a happy planner sticker book and this is the one that's called colorful boxes and I'm just going to put that down on Saturday and what I'm going to do is I'm going to again try to get it as centered as I can because I want to put some deco around it so there is that and then because I have it right in front of me I also have this awesome uh, sheet with a bunch of to-do list uh, sayings on them and they're in different colors which I really love so I am going to grab the nice bright green which is right down here I'm just going to grab that off and again this is clear which is really awesome so I'm kind of just going to layer that a little bit on the box but then put the rest of it on the top of the the page so in the white space we're going to do that there and then I also have these cool pay stickers payday stickers which I just got in a book today I'm actually I actually did a haul today I filmed a haul I'm not sure what's going to be up first probably this video since I do do these on Sunday but this is so awesome because they have little dollar bills that say payday which I absolutely think are so adorable so I'm going to go ahead and grab one off of here again just because they're kind of in my face and I am going to put that right down here over the box that says to buy since I know that that's the day I get paid and I'm going to do some shopping on that day. I'm gonna grab one of these checklist boxes and I'm just gonna put it on Sunday. Even though this a full box has space to write, I think I'm probably gonna put like an inspirational quote or something there. So I wanna put the, um, the heart checklist box down this way and I think what I'm gonna use for that is this nice bright sunny yellow. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put it on the second line, not all the way up to the top there. And just 
make sure we're okay so that's that for what I have to do on Sunday and then I'm going to just take a quick look again to see what other boxes I can pull in I've got a lot of stuff here that just has really great inspirational quotes so I don't it's one of those things where you have so much you don't know exactly what to pull I do know I want to pull um, this one here that says happy day in that nice bright green so I'm going to take that off of there and I think I'm going to put that right here so all right so I'm loving the way that's looking so far so I am just going to start picking out some deco we're not necessarily finished with the top as far as boxes or anything but I don't want to inundate it either with a lot of boxes so let me just take a quick look through what I have and then we'll be back to finish it off so what I did here was I added some more washi up top because again like I said I didn't want to inundate it with too many boxes since we already have the full boxes here and I'm just going to zoom, I want to zoom you in a bit just so that you could see the washi that I used also from the um, Jane Davenport. I want to say it's Jane, um, but I know it's Davenport collection at Michael's. There is the washi and because these seem to be like fashion girls and the colors are in the same scheme, I thought it would be appropriate for this uh, Kate Spade inspired layout. So I basically just did that across the bottom of the top box. And that's the way it looks. I really like, really, really like the way that came out. And then moving over to the sidebar here, I'm not sure what I'm going to do in in like total with the sidebar. But right here when it, where it says what my intuition is telling me, I pulled out a sticker from another sticker book um, from the Happy Planner. And I pulled this one out that says enjoy the moment. So that is what my intuition is telling me is to enjoy my moments it's like anything life is so fast and comes at you so fast and you know it just it, it just it does and it's and it's over before you know it so I want to enjoy every single moment then I want to pull in this um, simply gilded bow I just recently got this as a freebie in an order I placed and I thought that this would be absolutely appropriate for this spread just because of the colors and I'm going to put it over the words focus this week because I think it's going to cover that almost in its entirety that actually looks really really good that worked very well in that space so I like the way that came out um, again I've got to think about what I'm going to do here but we'll see and then we're going to do some more deco as well because I have um, a couple of other things for the end of the week and actually you know what I think I'm going to do I'm going to write in what I have so far I think that helps me in kind of figuring out what what other deco I want to put down before I completely turn this into a no white space type of spread um, so I want to write everything that I need to do down and then we'll take it from there so I'm going to do that off camera and then I'll be back so as you can see, I've written in some things that I have to do, like the um, physical, my son's dental appointment. And then I put this box here, which I just cut because it was a little too long, um, just to put down what my uh, filming schedule is, because I do have to edit and upload a video that I'm going to be filming tomorrow, and then also upload a blog post um, on that same day. So I'm going to do that. And then on these three days here at the beginning of the week, since I said I wanted to do kind of like inspirational quotes to myself, I pulled out this sticker sheet from the colorful boxes sticker book from the happy planner. I want to pull in this gold so that it can really stand out. And I'm going to just, um, put one of those boxes in the middle on each day, Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. I'm going to try to get it as much in the middle as I can and that way those will really stand out okay so those are down I've got to think about what inspirational quotes I may want to write to myself because um, I do want to write those to myself, but I'm going to do a little deco here. So for um, the top days here, I just want to grab a couple of uh, coffee cup icons. And again, this is from another sticker book from uh, Happy Planner. So I just want to grab some with some really nice, vibrant colors. So I'm just going to put this one down here. And actually, we'll just put it down there. Actually, I'll just pop it right in between there. And then I want to grab the same icon 
but this time with the bright pink, like the hot pink coffee sign there. And then I will put this on this part of the week on Friday. So that's there, and we're gonna do some more deco up there. I'm just gonna grab a couple of flower stickers here, um, also from the Happy Planner, and I'm just gonna grab these and kind of start putting them in different areas. There. And then let's see what else we have. Let's see if we can fit this down here, which I think that would look really pretty. That looks really nice and festive, very springy. And I have some more flower stickers here. Let's see what we can do. I'm gonna put a little one. I'll grab this hot pink one here. And then I will just put that down there for some contrast from the top and the bottom there. So I really wanna use a few stickers from these two sticker sheets that I pulled. Um, because again the color scheme is perfect and they are clear so you're gonna get a little bit of white space but that is absolutely fine um, so what I want to do is grab this one because again the color scheme is just so perfect it says be excited about everything so I'm just gonna grab that and I think what I'm gonna do is put that on Saturday right in the middle there and we'll add some more stuff around it just to add a little bit more decoration there and then I really want to grab this one in as well so I'm gonna go ahead and take that off the sheet and then we're gonna to have to layer that over something else but I am more than okay with that so what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna layer it in between these two days there And then this little one that says Friday, right there. I'm gonna grab that. I'm gonna put that right on Friday because heck yeah, we're happy when it's Friday. <laughs> so that looks really good because again, it's clear. So it just kind of layers over each other very well. Um, so I want to grab something from this sticker sheet that has a lot of foiling on it. Again, I just want it to be very uplifting and very happy. So let me just see what I've got here. All right, we're just going to put the best day because it doesn't matter what's going on, whether it's just a mundane type of day, every day should be the best day. So I'm going to pop that right up here. It's going to be a normal day. I'm going to be at work and my son has an appointment, but it's going to be the very best day ever. And that's what I'm going to work hard to make it is the very best day. So then let's see, I like this bloom sticker here. So I'm going to grab that off of there. And let's see, where am I going to put that? I think I'm going to put that right here. I'll figure out what else to put there, but I want to put that right there. I think that's very, very pretty. So the sticker that I'm putting down under the word bloom, I um, just cut because it was a little too big. And it says, I hope you feel beautiful today. So I am just going to put that, center that as much as I can. And there is that one there. And then I'm going to grab a couple of these small like firework stickers and I'm just going to place them in various areas just as a, actually, you know what, I think I'm gonna put them up here as kind of like a celebration. So we're gonna put that up there. I'm gonna grab a couple more of these and we'll put one over here. And then I've got one more, so I'll pull that out. And we're going to put that right there. Perfect. I love the way that looks. This color scheme is really coming together beautifully. Let me just zoom you out just a little bit so you can see how it's coming together. It's extremely colorful 
and just fun and vibrant. So really love the way everything is coming together so far. I'm going to grab these two stickers that say start today and get a girl. I'm going to use both of them in the Sunday box up top. So let me just move this over. Zoom you in again a little bit. And let's see how I want to do this. So yeah, I think I'm going to do it right at the top. I think that just helps me to kind of keep everything even. Grab this other one here that says get it girl. And I'm just gonna basically butt that up just against the first one. And of course it's uneven like it always is, but the message is perfect. So I absolutely love it. Um, so I'm gonna go back into this uh, sticker sheet because again, it is Clear, so I can put something down here underneath the two flags that I just put there. So this one is the perfect one. It says happy and it has those little kind of firework type of decorations. So I'm going to go ahead and put that under here. And I like the way that looks there. So I'm going to continue on just doing a little bit of deco. Um, especially for the day that I have to film. Um, I have this sticker sheet, which was a freebie from an Etsy shop that I made an order from uh, recently. This is the Sticker Attic Shop, and she has a gorgeous Traveler's Notebook sticker there. So I'm going to grab that off of there, and I'm going to put this right here, which looks so great. Then I'm also going to grab one of these cool little camera stickers from um, another Happy Planner sticker book that I bought today. And I'm going to also put that right there. And let's see what else we have to put. So since I'm going to be pretty busy that day, I just want to pull in this sticker, um, the coffee icon there from the same sticker sheet from the Sticker Attic Shop. And I'm going to put that right there. So that just signifies that I'm going to be having quite a busy day that day. Uh, let's see what else we've got here to put down as deco. I want to grab, actually from the same sheet, I'm going to grab this little paper clip with the bow on it. And I'm going to put that right over the green checklist that I have for Sunday. Loving the way that looks there. And I want something for up here because we've got a little bit of white space. So let me just see what I have and what I can put up there. What I'm going to do, since we don't have a lot of uh, horizontal space, but we have a lot of vertical space, is I'm actually going to take one of these stickers and turn it to the side and just place it down like that. So I'm going to grab this one that says, hey girl, and I'm going to just put it on the side here and let that speak for itself. I love that. That looks so good. I really, really do like that a lot. So going over back to the first page, I'm going to just write in a couple of inspirational quotes and then we'll be back. So for the quotes here, I just wrote, you are loved and needed. It gets better and make sure to love yourself unconditionally. I'm going to go back into the sticker sheet I had shown you earlier from the sticker attic shop and I'm just going to grab a couple of these suns just to kind of place around as kind of a little happy decoration. I'm just gonna grab the second one here. Actually, I can just put that here because I don't necessarily need that. Um, I'll put that there because we don't necessarily need that even with anything else. So that's gonna do it for this weekly plan with me. Um, again, I am extremely, extremely happy with the way this came out. I think that the idea I had in my head really came alive in the spread with all of these gorgeous Kate Spade inspired colors. And again, I wanted to keep the spread uh, very upbeat, very, very lively, very inspirational, and very much in a positive type of way. So I think I achieved both the coloring and also um, the way I wanted to make this page um, or the spread a very positive one for the upcoming week. Thank you so much for spending a few minutes of your day with me. I hope it is a plan with me that you enjoyed. Please leave a thumbs up on this video if you enjoyed it. Also, subscribe to the channel if you have not done so already. Also, click the little bell so you get alerted as to whenever I upload new content. Thanks again, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.